Hi, welcome back to the Gapster channel. I'm Gabby and uh, I've been using those uh, Tesman uh, pliers. Uh, they're basically like uh, wire strippers, wire cutters or crimpers, it does a whole bunch of things. And I've been using it for a while now. At first I got for like uh, well, doing some big electrical things. I thought it was going to help me, but I didn't realize it actually works so well on any wire. So if you want to strip a wire, just put it like this and just instantly like this and not just big wires even the smallest thinnest wires you can put there's nothing to adjust and voila just like that it's so simple you want to cut a wire you just use a cutter right here there are crimpers right here and another cool feature it has a, a sensing uh, uh, here so it senses electrical power so you could see how it actually senses uh, a wire proximity. So this is like a, a, a live a wire detector. So it's got uh, multiple functions. But I really like the uh, wire stripper part and so they are so easy to use. Having once I had this, I ended up finding myself using it all the time. So I ended up getting all the some of the other Tesman products that are very good quality. And mainly I got this uh, multimeter uh, tester basically and uh, uh, to, to use and uh, what I love about it is it's actually had a very clear uh, display and uh, it does a lot of things. So first one thing I like about it is if you leave it on auto as soon as you power it goes in auto mode and you don't have to say I want to use it for AC or DC or check the ohms or the continuity. So as soon as you turn it on, it just automatically uh, goes in auto mode. So if you, for example, do continuity, it automatically knows and it just goes right there. If you want to check DC volt, it knows, AC volt, it knows, um, so there's no need to do anything. The display is beautiful, it's big and very, uh, very easy to read from a distance. Now you can also, if you want to, like you're doing always continuity, you could press the function and say, I just want to do continuity. Well, other things that does have it, you can actually count the, uh, the frequency. It has a frequency counter. It can test uh, capacitors. For example, this is a little WEMA capacitor. It's a 0 0.33. Let's just do a quick one here on the fly. And here it is, 328. So that's close enough. So that basically measures capacitors, it measures diode. NCV it basically detects a wire, like live wire, like we were doing earlier and uh, there's live you basically use a red probe and if it's a live wire it will tell you it's a live wire this is a true rms uh, uh, multimeter so it's actually a very good quality and accuracy there's a lot of bunch of features that i still uh, discovering uh, on how to use them and this is for example it's kind of built-in light on the back so that's a pretty cool feature so I've been loving this thing I've been actually using it all the time it's, it's this is when you know you love a product when you actually end up using it a lot so after that I got uh, this from Tesman actually this is a uh, if you don't have one of these this is a, a live wire detector this is a must if you ever troubleshooting uh, with some electrical stuff say let's Say, let's say you want to turn the breaker on a certain circuit off and you don't know which breaker it is. Basically plug this thing into your, your socket. So what I do is I plug it into the socket and this thing is beeping so I'm hearing it. Then I go start fiddling around with the breakers and keep turning one after the other till eventually this thing shuts off and then I know I got the right breaker. So something like this can be really indispensable. This also has a cool uh, uh, light as well if you want to look at something. And uh, after that I've got this also from Tesman. This is a uh, Basically, it detects all kind of stuff. It detects uh, basically magnetic fields. So if I put it on magnetic and I bring it closer here to something that has transformers, it automatically uh, lights up. You can also activate the sound. So as you get closer, 
can see just getting there's a lot of transformers here so it's going bananas uh, so other thing that uh, the other thing on this thing is you got a function is you got electrical so it actually detect if there is any electrical field so if you put it on a electric wire here it's detecting there's some electricity and it also has RF so it can detect uh, radio frequency so it's a pretty good device it can be handy uh, I use it a lot for the magnetic field I'm trying to reduce like the transformer effect on my system so that's a pretty cool thing the only thing I found about it that I wasn't too crazy about is on the electrical on the electrical it seems like the frequency goes to 500 Hertz and I found sometimes if you want to find like noise on my line it did not do uh, the job for that so this is not probably for finding noise on your line but otherwise it can detect all the other things which is pretty cool so all in all these guys have some really cool products from like I said those pliers I love the multimeter this one I use all the time so is the uh, line tester as well uh, this one I don't use it as much it's one of those things uh, that you only use it from time to time but if you ever need something like that it's definitely a handy gadget uh, to have what I like about the Tesman product is actually give you the batteries and not just any batteries like these are Duracell batteries I'm going to put a link in the description below about all these you can get them off Amazon and these are affiliate links it does help the channel if you are thinking of ordering something like this or even anything electronic just clicking on those links and buying whatever you want it does help your channel it's one way to help the channel it's not a lot but you know dollar here dollar there just end up helping a little bit uh, but trust me I wouldn't do this video if I didn't really like those products because they're actually not that uh, expensive and there really is not a lot of money into these things but they are really good they're very inexpensive and they're good quality to use I'll be using this one especially a lot uh, lately it seems to be hanging around me everywhere because uh, I'm always tinkering building things so this seems to be hanging around with me all the time uh, I will put a link in the description up here about my uh, Gapster TD1 DAC if anybody's interested it's a DIY uh, DAC that you can build if you know a little bit of DIY it's one of the probably the best DACs you can ever uh, get in here in this corner here I'm going to put the link about 10 songs that you can listen to on your system these are very high quality songs that you can really showcase your system or help you set up your system I'll have uh, my patreon link is in the description below if you feel like helping the channel and have some insight on some early products and also there will be a speaker in the middle if you'd like to subscribe to the channel and help me out as well take care and I hope to see you again